Hi everyone, welcome back to my next vlog. We're continuing, oh, and I, as soon as I started that, they started sawing over there. Uh, we are continuing our, um, our minivan build. We are in a, uh, in south, we're not far from Klamath Falls. We're in between Klamath Falls and, uh, and Medford. Uh, and which is where I'm spending my summer because that's where my mom is. And I want, before we walk over to see the progress on the minivan build, all right, come over here, you. I want you to see this fantastic, okay, fantastic lake that I'm camped on. This is my campsite. Can you believe this? I mean, here's my van. Let me come around over here. There's my van. And uh, come back, come back. There you go. And this is my camp. Can you believe that? It says you can't find anywhere a prettier camp. Now, if Mount McKinley were in the background there, that'd be prettier. But come on, let's face it, folks. You can't expect Mount McKinley to be everywhere you go. So uh, I just want you to see this beautiful camp I'm in. Now, let's go walk over to the van build, and we will take check it out. Let me... Uh, turn you around and I'll show you things as we go along. My van, a couple of the guys over here camping with us. I'm on a gimbal as you can imagine and uh, boy it's working well I think, I hope. So just a quick and you get a lot of the up and down motion, I know you do. Let me try to do the ninja walk. What? Oh. Okay, how about that? And here's another guy. We got somebody living in this ranger here with us. And of course, there's the lake. You know, these guys are, there's the lake back there, right on the lake. You can't really see it. You can just barely see it through the brush there. I'll come over here and show you. Some of our folks enjoying the beautiful spades. And uh, someone else camping here on the lake. There it is. Can you imagine being camped here uh, on this gorgeous, gorgeous lake? Man, I love this camp. This is the kind of camp that we are trying to provide for some new person. Uh, the, let me tell you more about the minivan build. Uh, we have bought this minivan and we are uh, converting it, getting ready to live in, and we're going to then donate it to some person in need. We will have an application process. You can learn all about that. Neighbors nearby. People walking along. You guys okay being on the, vi on the video? They were not going to hear you, but you'll see you. And there's some of our hard, hard workers working really, really hard. Actually, they really are working very hard. You don't see it right this second, but they are. And we've got a pretty nice camp set up. Uh, one of our members has a nice Honda 3000. You can probably hear that a little loud right there. Sitting on the front of his uh, Class C. And the minivan we're going to build and give away. And chop saw we have between us. And we have got tools here. So here's a chop saw. Can you see that chop saw? Let's see, I want to go down. Oh yeah, there you go, you can see that. And here's the minivan. Making really amazing progress on this minivan build. I mean, just amazing progress. Let's go take a better look at this. So we have got the, uh, we've got the carpet out, the floor down. We're going to put on vi uh, vinyl, but we're getting the bed ready to go. Uh, you can see we're going to build these frames underneath the bed. It's going to be a two by two frame. It'll be three legs. We've, uh, so none of this is attached, but it's all ready to go in and be worked on and get done. So we've got the flooring. This is the third day of the van, of the van build. First day was uh, barbecue and greetings and planning, and day two was the floor, and Cliff here did most all of that. Cliff, you want to say, oh, they can't hear you. 
All they can do is see you. James and Cliff did. Yes, yes, James and Cliff, James absolutely. Did Cliff did it, and James was the main uh, assistant. assistant. Did a fantastic job. Absolutely. Between the two of them, they man, it's amazing what they did yesterday. Okay, let me go around and show you in here. So here's the bed, what the bed will look like. We'll have a kitchen across the back, pretty standard. Pretty standard minivan build. Bed across the back. So, let me see. Can I show you? You can see we cut out around the doors. Uh, that door will open and close, but uh, won't be used much. The, we left, let me see if I can get back off and get that turned to focus. There you go. We left a uh, curve here to make it easy to get in and out of the, between the front seats. And So that's the progress we've made, and that's a lot of progress. I mean, that is just in a, a really, really amazing amount of progress here. And made it shorter. We took it apart and made it a little shorter. So it doesn't stick out and it can't be kicked. So that's just, uh, I'm just giving you a quick peek. Uh, let me walk away. Walking, walking, walking away. Oops, don't do that. And then uh, let me get over here. Okay, I'll do a, uh, just to close up this video, just to see, you can see progress. Day three, the first day was just planning. We had a barbecue, just gathered. Day two, we did the floor, got it mostly cut. We got it all cut out, ready to install. Uh, here it is day three, the floor is attached. Uh, we plan to get the vinyl, the, to put the, uh, the vinyl linoleum down tonight and have it drying. And uh, the bed is, as you just saw, nearly entirely done. Uh, just the progress has been astounding and fast and amazing. Uh, and so we're going to get this thing kicked out. Well, we'll give you enough, uh, we'll do updates on the vlog um, all the way through. And I'm not sure it'll be daily, but it'll be pretty often. So there you go. You can just see that we've not made some real progress. Uh, and why are we doing this? Because this America has become a, a, a high rent, high cost of living, low wage nation. And we can argue all day about how that happened. I don't know that. How, I don't know if anyone knows how that happened. A long chain of events. I don't think you can pick out any one person or any one party or choose anything. It's just been a long chain of events that has turned this into a high cost of living, low wage nation. And so that's what we are. That's where we are. Uh, and so uh, let me get this thing adjusted. You know, I fuss. I, that stuff bothers my mind. There you go. You can see the van. Uh, so many people have a, a low wage. Uh, they're on retirement, Social Security, disability, uh, pension, or even working a job or two jobs and can't afford to rent can't afford to buy a place to eat, to, buy, to both eat and have a home at the same time. I bet a third of this country makes that decision every month. It's the end of the month, we're broke, the, all the money's gone, and next month is just around the corner, the rent's just around the corner. Do I, do I go to the doctor and see this problem? Do I buy my prescription drugs? Do I buy food? And do I pay the rent? Do I pay the electric? That's a common, common, common decision in this country. It's a very sad and pathetic situation. And uh, so, all right. So, uh, we're, the Homes on Wheels Alliance is uh, doing everything we can. It's our goal to be, do the fundraising, raise the money, and then be able to uh, to give away minivans. I'd like to do at least one a month, give away 12 a year and more, many, many more. There's a lot of need and uh, we can't meet it all, but we're gonna meet all we can, that's all we can do. And you say, well, you're, not, you're just a dent against the tidal wave of need in this country. Well, that's fine. I'm good with, with being just a, a, a drip. Uh, I've helped one. I can't help them all. I can help one. And I'm good with helping the one. Uh, 
this one person, I've made their life better, and that's good enough for me. Okay, I'm going to stop. I'll go on and on, as you know me. The minivan's really coming along. We'll do it again tomorrow. You'll see how much progress we've made. We're also doing videos about all the build, how we did the curves, how we're building the legs, on and on and on. Uh, and so, thanks for watching. Uh, I thank you for supporting the channel. All the money that, of, uh, other than my basic, most basic cost of living, all the money that my YouTube channel makes, and it's considerable, uh, goes right here. Uh, I gave the money to Howa. Howa went and bought this minivan. Uh, we just ordered all the solar. Um, if there's not enough, I'll write another check as a donation to Howa, and we'll get the solar. That's how this is all being done. And I'd like for you to help. We have a Howa wish list, and go to the description, and you can find the Howa wish list. And uh, you could buy things for this one, this person. Whoever gets this van, we'll give them everything they need to get set up and have a whole life of their own. So help. You can't help all, I can't help all, I can help one person in one small way. Go to the wish list and buy one thing. We have a lot of small amount items on there. If you have the money, buy a big amount item. Go to the Howa channel go, uh, website, homesonwheelsalliance.org. Uh, click on that donate button, give us five bucks. If, if a thousand of you went out now and gave five bucks and, uh, and 50 of you went out and gave a hundred and, and you did it regularly and if you did it whenever you could, it wouldn't be a tiny drop in the bucket. We'd be really helping people, helping a lot of people. And that's what we're after. And of course, we're going to go after the foundations and the big money. There's a lot of big money in this country and we want to go out and get it just as well. Okay, I'm going to stop. Thanks for watching this. Uh, if you got anything out of us, if you believe in the mission I'm trying to accomplish here, uh, hit, the, hit the subscribe button. That helps more than you can imagine. Uh, my, how many people see my videos are based on the subscriptions. It's based on the commenting. Go write a comment. Tell me what you think about what we're doing. How could we do this better? How could you help do this? You want to be in on the next minivan build? Uh, I plan, I'd like to do one, at least one more this summer as, as finances allow. And so uh, support us. Uh, go to my Patreon channel and, and support us there. There will be a, a link at the very end of this video. Stay to the end or go or fast forward to the end and there's a Patreon link. Give me a buck a month. Give me a buck a month and all that dollar will go to the, one of these minivans or it'll go to supporting people in need. Okay, I better stop there. I'll just go on and on. You know me. Let me get this back around a bit. And so, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later. Now i got to turn you off. <laughs>